everyone and welcome to weather. So June 1st marked the start of the Atlantic hurricane season, which runs until November 30th. Now, there is a high probability for above normal number of storms and hurricanes to form in the area of interest to Trinidad and Tobago. But remember, this outlook is not a landfall forecast. It only highlights possible tropical cyclone activity in the area of interest for Trinidad and Tobago. However, you should not wait until an alert watch or warning is issued to start your preparations now the hurricane season is the portion of the year having the highest incidence of tropical storms or hurricanes and this is for the atlantic the caribbean and the gulf of mexico which is the atlantic basin and it is the period from june 1st to november 30th with the peak occurring between mid-august and late october so as we move through this hurricane season this is a list we are working with for the Atlantic Tropical Cyclone names. Now checking to the satellite imagery, we can see a few tropical waves in the mix. Firstly, this one coming in from the east, then another in the central Atlantic and one also leaving the west coast of Africa. So pretty similar to last week's trajectory and we saw those showers that were more so isolated, some heavy and even thundery. But for the most part, Trinidad and Tobago can expect some of the, those scattered showers ahead. And of course, these two out here both posing no threat to us at this time, but will be monitored by the Trinidad and Tobago Meteorological Service. But back in current conditions earlier, Piaku had a high at 32.7 degrees Celsius. Right now it's at 29. And Crown Point's high earlier today was 32.2, but right now it's at 28 degrees Celsius. Now checking in tonight's forecast, Tobago watch for a cloudy night ahead along with a thunderstorm late around alongside a low at 26 degrees Celsius for Crown Point. At Piaco, Trinidad tonight, temperatures should dip to a low at 24 degrees Celsius and you can expect these similar conditions as well. However, more on the partly cloudy side for Trinidad. Now checking to Tuesday in Tobago, look out for those brief morning showers still with the cloudy skies and with a max at 31 degrees Celsius at Crown Point. And here in Trinidad, Piaco can expect also a higher 31 degrees Celsius. And similarly, you can expect these conditions as well, along with these party cloudy conditions becoming mostly cloudy and windy as your day moves along. And there is the medium to high which is 40 to 70 percent chance of the heavier shower and or the isolated thunderstorm favoring the windward. Now looking ahead to Wednesday, you can expect some partly cloudy to cloudy skies, breezy and hazy conditions around with just a few light to moderate showers as well as the medium 40 percent chance of the isolated heavier shower or thunderstorm favoring more so Trinidad. Then into your Thursday, you can expect only some partly cloudy, breezy and hazy skies with the isolated shower as well. Now in the marine forecast, seas are moderate with waves from 1.5 to 2 meters in open waters and near 1 meter in sheltered areas. And to your tides, Port of Spain high tides will be at 1.39 a.m. and 2.55 p.m. while low tides are at 8.24 a.m. and 8.12 p.m. and high tides at Scarborough will be at 1.32 a.m. and 2.42 p.m. with low tides at 8.16 a.m. and 8.12 p.m. So for your recap now the Atlantic hurricane season has begun so do not wait till an alert is issued be prepared. Back to you Keisha.